Hey everyone, Sean Vicentiner here from the Silver Bow Fly Shop in Spokane, Washington. Today I want to discuss with you the importance of selecting the right size leaders for the size flies that you're using in our Spokane Coeur d'Alene region or anywhere in the Rocky Mountain um, region for example. And we have lots of leaders and tippets on the wall. I just want to help simplify the process of selecting which leaders and tippets to use. More often than not I hear anglers complaining about not getting the right turnover or the leaders twisting up or breaking off flies, but if we match those tippet diameters of our leaders up to those flies more accurately, you're gonna get great turnover, you're gonna break off less flies, and the presentation, the current is gonna be really good. So let's take a look at what size leaders and tippets to match up with your flies. There are three common sizes that I use when I'm trout fishing the Spokane Coeur d'Alene area or anywhere in the West. Those three sizes are 3X, 4X, and 5X. The reason why I've selected those is those are going to cover 75% of our trout fishing needs. Now 3X is a little bit larger diameter than 4X, 4X is a little bit larger diameter than 5X, and so forth. Now there's X numbers that are uh, thicker diameter than that, and there's ones that are smaller, but those three right there are kind of your core sizes. And how I remember which ones to use when, well remember, 3X is the thickest, so use that with bigger bugs like stoneflies and Chernobyls, larger nymphs and streamers, that sort of thing. 4X is a great all-around size for parachute atoms, royal wolves, standard elk hair caddis, so flies that are in that 12, 14, 16 size range. And then 5X is great for your really small flies, small elk hair caddis, maybe late summer, or a little blue winged olive or midge. Now again, these are not gonna represent all the flies that you need to, to use during the season, but overall, this is gonna cover you 75% of the time. So if you have these three in your, your vest or your, or your pack, and you have the tippet to match them, these three will cover you and get you in the ball game most of the time. One last tip I have for you when selecting leaders for trout fishing around our area is actually leader length. Under normal situations, a nine foot leader on a floating line is perfect. Now, if you're fishing dry dropper setups or maybe two dries, or maybe a really wind resistant fly like a, one of those big bushy chubby Chernobyl patterns, you might want to shorten up and go to a seven and a half or eight foot leader. Cutting off a little bit of that tippet from a nine foot will work just fine or you can buy seven and a half foot liters already pre-packaged. On the opposite end of that spectrum, let's say it's late summertime, fish are a little more wary. Uh, nine foot liters, maybe not stealthy enough. You wanna go to a longer liter like a 12 footer. So you can add a little bit of tippet to your liter, maybe another foot or two at the most, or you can buy a pre-packaged liter that's in that 12 foot range and that'll help extend out the distance between your fly and your line and help give you that extra advantage that you need in those um, situations where the fish are a little more spooky. All right, that wraps up today's discussion about leaders. If you have questions, email us on the shop website, silverbowflyshop.com, or in the comments section below. Otherwise, check out our other videos for fishing tips around the Spokane Coeur region, and we'll see you guys at the shop. Thanks.